I am just a poor boy, though my story is seldom told. I have squandered my resistance for a pocket full of mumbles, such are promises. That's the beginning of The Boxer by Paul Simon, and I'm going to teach you how to play it in this video. Hit the red subscribe button, and let's go. First of all, I am doing this with my capo on the third fret because it fits my voice better that way. So if you're playing along with me, you also need to put a capo in the same place. After you learn the song, you can move the capo up and down the neck to better fit your voice, or you can take the capo off. It's up to you. First, I'm going to show you the chords. I'll show you the picking pattern, and then I'll put it all together. Underneath this video will be a link to the words and the chords for the whole song. So the chords are a C. A minor, G, F. Now those are just the chord shapes. Technically, I am not playing a C chord here, it's just the C shape. And the reason it's not a C chord is because I've put the capo on the third fret. But if you think of it as a C, then you'll know what shape to put your fingers in. All right, so the picking pattern is a Travis pick. So a Travis pick is more about the rhythm than it is about exactly what strings you're plucking. It's, the rhythm is one, two, and three, and four, and. There's variations, but that's the rhythm that I'm teaching you here. So you're going to be plucking, and I'm doing it on a, which should I start on? A C chord, I think. So for the C chord, I'm plucking the bass note for the C chord, which is the fifth string. And I'm also plucking the second string. So that's the first beat. Then I'm playing, and these are the string numbers. Four, three, four, two, four, three. Okay, so play this with me, and I'll call out the string numbers as we go. So, bass two, four, three, four, two, four, three. Pluck, four, three, four, two, four, three. If you speed it up, I'll give you a close-up too. Here's a close-up. I am playing with my thumb and my index finger. Uh, my left hand is a C chord with the capo on the third fret. So we're plucking the second string and the bass together, and the bass on the C chord is the fifth string. So pluck those together. Then use your thumb to pluck the fourth string. Three is the index finger. Four. Two, four, three, bass. If that Travis picking is still too uh, complicated for you, maybe a little too fast for you. I do have a lesson video where I do nothing but teach that picking pattern and I'll put a link underneath this video so you can check that out. So um, let's look at the bass notes for each one of these chords. So the bass note for the C is the fifth string. The bass note for the A minor is also the fifth string. When you get to the G, the bass note is going to be that top string. And for the F, if you're playing the fourth string version of the F, the bass note is going to be the fourth string. If you play the fifth string version, then it's going to be the fifth string. If you're playing a bar chord, it's going to be the sixth string. Okay? All right, here we go. I am just a poor boy, though my story seldom told. I have squandered my resistance. For a pocket full of mumbles, such are promises. All eyes and just still a man hears what he wants to hear and disregards. 
guards arrest When I left my home and my family I was no more than a boy In the company of strangers In the quiet of a railway station Running scared the words and the chords underneath. So there's a cool thing that you can do in the chorus to emphasize one part of that A minor chord and they, they do that on the original recording and here's how you can sort of duplicate that. I'll sing the last line of the uh, verse leading into the chorus and you can hear what I'm doing. Looking for the places only they would know. Light a Now, I'm going to play the song again, and this time I'm going to do it a little faster. Here we go. I am just a poor boy, though my story's seldom told. I have squandered my resistance for a pocket full of mumbles, such are promises. All lies in just still a man hears what he wants to hear and disregards the rest. subscribe button if you haven't already, the like button and uh, the notification bell. If you want more lessons, I got a whole bunch of them here at my channel, mostly for guitar players, but a few for mandolin and ukulele. If you want to know more about my original music, it's at jamieanderson.com. Thanks for tuning in. It really means a lot to me.